Howdy y'all, I'm Round the Wheel, you're watching 46 Okanin Monogatari, the Shinkaron, aka EVO, the Theory of Evolution. And last time, uh, I made it to the Thelotus Village, but I got kicked out because I forgot to leave my Cursed Light at home. Gets me every time. And then at the end of the video, I got ambushed by a slightly, slightly stronger Thelotus than myself. Uh, so we're going to uh, go over some things first. So we will... So we have these things. I did wasn't going to do this, but I'm turning on my cursor capture because there are some things I want to point out. We've got the menu here. Uh, chart Evo is how we're going to grow. Uh, Evo history and encyclopedia. I think eat history tracks your evolution. Uh, history. Needless to say, I guess. And Evo encyclopedia will give you little facts about anything that you've evolved into. So we have chart Evo. This is the big one right here. So when we want to evolve, we're going to go here and spend our Evo genes. We start out with four, so we can already make ourselves a little stronger. And we can move in one of four directions. Attack, you know, stronger jaws, as you can see by this nice little angry Pac-Man here. We have angry Pac-Man. We have uh, endurance for, uh, for defense. That's uh, stoic Pac-Man. We have lovey-dovey Pac-Man here. For vitality which is more hit points and we have wisdom uh brain pac-man which is uh not exactly sure what wisdom does perhaps the game will tell me if i feel so inclined but here's our evolution chart over here so we can go off in several branches as you can see we can also go in a direction we can also go off the sides of the chart and that will result in a in a game over without any real consequence but i think each point where you can go off the chart has its own different like uh game over like it, it has its own creature and you, what happens is you end up evolving into creatures that for whatever reason like either it's like a like a fish or a dinosaur that say for example like wasn't made for these times like if you turn into a dinosaur during the ice age or or, or if it's something that just gets domesticated in some weird way, you get a nice little cutscene about that. But there are lots of those, and maybe if we diverge toward the edges of the chart, we'll try to hit some of those. But, uh, so we can spin our Evo genes by using the arrow keys. We can go in any direction. I'm going to go for... Right now I want to go for some chompers in case I get in a Thelotus fight. We can do endurance anytime we want. But we will evolve into something, I believe. So we have a number in right here and a number in parentheses. And when we when we raise our attack or whatever stat we raise, the number that's not in parentheses will go up. So I'm going to get a better pair of jaws. I'm going to There's no and there's no incentive to hang on to your Evo genes. Like as soon as you get them, you should spin them because you should just make yourself It's not like Evo the search for Eden where you're like I gotta grind 5,000 points to get those jaws I want. No, it's like you can you can go in immediately. Like now, and our chart stretches out. I've spent my Evo genes. I've put them all on attack because I don't ever want to get rocked by a Thelotus like that again. And then we push escape. And it says, are you sure? You can confirm if this is how you want to spend your Evo points. So if you accidentally push an arrow in a direction you don't want to do, you can cancel it. But yes, I'm sure. We're going to get... A stronger jaw now we're gonna go around doing some fights first of all uh, I know even some finer details are hard to see uh, but it looks like we've got just a line of enemies coming at us here a jellyfish is what we want to fight right now so I'm going to go ahead and fight the jellyfish I deal two points of damage to it and I receive one point that's not too bad so I'm going to let's see what a special does do I have to charge up for my special Oh, my only special right now is recovering health, so I don't want to do anything like that. I just want to fight. So I deal two points of damage, and it goes back and forth like this in this way. I probably still don't want to fight the Lotuses, having doing two points of damage as opposed to whatever I was doing, I guess. Oh, I've defeated the Jellyfish, and I received one Evo Gene, which I can now spend in another direction if I so choose. But it looks like... Oh, I got another jellyfish attack. Hopefully we'll see maybe a critical attack from either end here. A desperate attack. A desperate attack is a critical it 
attack from my end. There's actually different terminology if the enemy scores a critical attack against you. But uh, desperate attacks are good. They don't, they're not the uh, terrible thing that the game makes them sound like. I'm not attacking you because I'm desperate. Uh, I'm making a desperate lunge because I'm awesome. Oh, I hit the surface of the ocean. Yes, that does hurt you. But I've taken a little bit of a health hit. You can, uh, you can recover just by sitting, but you can also recover more quickly. Hopefully nobody attacks me here while I'm trying to explain this. I can prevent that, actually, now that I think about it. So right here... I know even some finer details are hard to see because of the way that the screen is organized. So let's go. So there are these little bubbles here. This is kind of a little geyser. I can sit here and heal even faster than I could just by passively sitting. But we've got two more uh, Evo genes. So we can spin them. Do we want to spin them on Jaws? I think we do. I, I see no reason at this point. I'll go for Endurance once I've got a better set of Jaws. And now I'm going to go ahead and turn my uh, cursor capture off. Because I think that's everything I wanted to show off with the cursor. So, let's get on it. Let's, let's go ahead. Uh, so my attack is up to 14. I am an attacker. I am. Alright. Am I sure? Uh, yes, I am. That's kind of... Ooh, that could, be, that could be dangerous later. Come here. Did I accidentally touch the surface? I think I did. Alright, a jellyfish attacks. I attack it. Okay, I'm already doing more damage with my uh, awesome new jaws. Okay, it's doing one attack to me. And I received one Evo Gene. Yeah, the grind for Evo Genes is a little slow at first, but that's okay. It's not nearly as bad as it is. Oh, see, there it is. That's an unlucky attack, but fortunately it didn't do anything worse to me than a normal attack did. I guess it's proportional somehow, like if they were doing 2 damage to me, maybe it's doing like 0.5 damage to me and it does twice as much so it rounds up to 1 so it still looks like 1. I don't know, I'm just kind of feeling it out. Love the music though, this is the actually the boss theme in Evo The Search for Eden. It's been downgraded to a normal encounter theme here. Hey, I got myself a desperate attack. There we go. I've defeated the enemy and received one Evo Gene. So let's give ourselves an opportunity to get something new here. We're going to go chart Evo and... Yes, I want to evolve. Let's do it. You will evolve into Hemicyclaspis. That sounds fun. See, so now I've gone... Now I've gone to... Uh, let me get the cursor out again. Okay. So now I've gone over to, I've gone from the top of the chart here to, I've diverged to the right over here. I guess if I keep, I guess if I kept going all in on attack, I'd eventually charge over to the right here. But now I've evolved into a Hemocyclops, class, or I will evolve. You'll see it in this little screen right here. This, this screen right here is for showing you what you are right now. I'm a Thelotus currently, but I'm about to be a Hemocyclaspis. And so let's take the cursor back off. I've shown you pretty much everything I need to show you. And yes, let's hit it. Oh wow. I have a weird I have a weird very uh, mainly ate plankton, but uh, this hemocyclaspis is going to be mainly eating uh, jellyfishes and the lotuses. Lived in estuaries and swam slowly among riverbeds. Era inhabited Silurian to Devonian. So we're gonna take my weird uh, Johnny Tightlips mouth and we're gonna try to we're gonna try to get a little big for our britches here. You wanna you wanna take me on? Anybody? Any takers? A Thelotus attacks. I'm gonna do a regular attack right now. I don't think I have I have a new special with my jaws. Well, I have defend. I can. I can maybe soak up less damage if I get unlucky striked, uh, but I'm going to fight. I dealt two damage to him, and I received three, so maybe I'm not ready to be really do the whole Thelotus thing yet, so I'm going to try to escape. Damn, I couldn't get away. Uh, can I do it? I managed to give it the slip, thank god. I need to... Okay. Do not block my access to the... There we go. Okay, I fully healed. So, I need to kind of get in a better position to 
fight Thelotuses. This is a very Thelotus infested water right now. So I need to keep fighting jellyfishes. I'm gonna fight a jellyfish and do four damage to it. Yeah, we're really going hard on the jellyfish at this point. I've defeated the enemy and received one Evo Gene. I'll pretty much put Evo Genes. Whoa, no, 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 no. See if I can spawn something else here by going off screen. No, it's the Lotus is all the way down. This is a little bit distressing. But let's go ahead and start uh, putting points into Endurance. So now I have to go, now that I've gone so hard on, uh, on attack, it's going to take a lot longer to evolve that. Maybe I should get some Endurance because that's the easiest thing to go for right now. I'm going to be a Hemocyclaspis for a while, it looks like. But I'm just going to get myself a little bit more of everything. Uh, so this is going to be grinding, so we don't look at this when we're on camera. So I'll be back when I am a little bit better, a little bit of a better looking specimen. Okay, so this is definitely something worth noting. This happens every now and then at random intervals. You'll get surrounded by a red tide, which sounds like the worst thing. And it does a little bit of damage to you, but you also get some free Evo genes out of it, which you can spend immediately for fun and profit. So let's go do that. What should we do with our freebie 8 Evo genes? I think we should probably... We need to be able to take down the Lotuses, so attack is definitely the most important thing. But we also need to be able to soak up some hits and uh, also do some... Uh, probably take some as well. So let's go... We've gone Endurance. Let's go 2 for Endurance, 2 for Vitality, and 4 for Attack. That looks good to me right now. Uh, yes, I'm sure. There's really hardly a wrong way to evolve in this game, as far as I can tell. So, let's see if we are maybe not... Let's go ahead and save so that we can, uh... I'm saving on file 2, just to, uh, prevent anything bad from happening. Let's see if we're maybe a little better equipped to take on a Thelotus now. Come at me, bro! Alright, do it. I'm dealing 4 points of damage, and I'm receiving 2, so that's a pretty good trade-off, I would say. Especially if I end up doing... Uh, a desperate attack. That would be great as well. I don't want any unlucky strikes, though. Alright, we've dealt four damage to the enemy, and we're receiving two Evo Genes per per attack now. So we're not quite... We're not quite one-shotting these things, but... As long as an unlucky strike doesn't happen, and even if it does, we can maybe take one. So I'm dealing four points of damage. See, there's an unlucky attack right there. I received four points of damage, too. But I got a Desperate Attack in, so it looks like Desperate Attacks are doing anywhere from one to one, one and a half to two times what they're supposed to. Uh, okay, there we go. So, alright, yeah, Thelotus is working out really well right now. Are you really gonna come at me in my, in my Spa Geyser? How dare you, sir? I think you're the one that came at me. I don't know, you all kind of look the same to me. So, I'm going to go ahead and attack you. I get a Desperate Attack. Desperate Attacks seem to happen a fair bit more often. Alright, and I've defeated the Thelotus. Now, now I am a strong specimen of a Hemocyclaspis or whatever I'm supposed to... Not Hemo, Hemi. I've been swallowed by an enormous current! Oh no, did that damage me and give me Evo points? It gave me six Evo genes, so I didn't know about the current. That's... That's a little bit more of a rare occurrence than a... Alright, let's go ahead and fight. After this fight, we should have quite a few Evo points to spend, so... Let's go ahead, then. Alright, enemy attacks. I received two points. Very good. My attack. It's a desperate attack, which is going to win the day for me. I've got two Evo genes, which puts me up to 14. That is a... I like the pacing. The pacing is going well for us right now. I honestly don't know what Wisdom does, but I feel like maybe, I don't know, maybe it'll give me more Desperate Strikes? I don't know. Maybe it'll increase my criticals. I honestly couldn't tell you what that stat does, but let's see. I could I could evolve more attack right now. I could really go hard in the pain if I wanted to. I don't think I want to get that far just yet, though. I have 14. How do I want to split this up? We'll go... We'll go... Four points on each end over here, and then six on attack. I'm liking this a lot. Oh boy. Uh, yes. Now I should really be kicking some th the Lotus butt. 
Yeah, see, now I'm going for them. Now I'm just going super hard in the paint. Six points of damage, and I'm only receiving one. So yeah, I need to be moving on. An unlucky attack. How dare you. Your entire family is going to feel this injustice. Yeah, see, now I'm just going super hard on these guys. Oh, it's an unlucky attack, though. I, uh... Maybe I ought to try to escape because I didn't realize how much damage I was taking. And I couldn't get away. The enemy attacked me. Oh, well, I only received one hit point of damage, though. Maybe I can... Boy, yeah, I am not good at giving people the slip, which means I have game overed. My hubris has done me in. Uh, so how am I... Did that take me back to... What did that take me back to attack-wise? Oh, the very beginning nearly of the evolutionary chain i think i saved after last saved after endurance uh is that really the last time i saved oh crap okay so yeah so here i am in this area and i currently have okay i'm a little better off now okay well not significantly but you know the nice, the nice payoff that the current gave me was undone. So yeah, you have to evolve and you have to fight, but you also have to to not be a haughty jerk like me. You actually have to still use some. You have to still use some. Uh, what's that word of the thing I'm obviously not using? Some caution, some prudence. Yeah, something like that. So uh, let's uh, let's go back to the menu and try to get back up to where we were. Uh, Will I get hit by another current? Hit me with a current game. That would be... Cold currents draw near and the water's temperature drops. Well, I get six Evo Gs for that. That's nice. Okay. So we might want to stay in the cold current for now. Alright, looks, like looks like the polar vortex has passed. So, let's get to a point... You've pretty much seen what I can do in this area. Let's get to a point where I don't really need to hang out here anymore, and then we'll be back after that. Okay, at this point, I am absolutely tearing up the lotuses like tissue paper. So let's go for some evolution. I've got 12 genes. I'm going to give myself, let's see, I need five to evolve in, in the endurance direction, which I think I'm going to do. So I'm going to go one, two, three, four... And then one, two, three. Almost evolve attack, but not quite. And then let's go for an endurance evolution. I'm going to do it. We're going to evolve into Cephalaspis. And we moved over to the left on our evolution chart. So it's a lateral move, but uh, 20 centimeters in length. It ate plankton, clung to riverbeds, and sucked up prey while swimming. Ancestor of the Lamprey. And it's from the Devonian era. So, okay, let's, let's see what it takes to evolve now. It's only going to take one point to move down the chain, so I think we may as well do that. So let's go ahead and do such like as that. See, here's how here's how well it's going. Wow. So they're not even making a dent in me now. It's I'm doing so much damage that I'm just absolutely ripping people apart. So I got enough genes to evolve attack. So yes, I'm going to do it. We're going to evolve into Jim Uendina. What is a Jimuendina? Hopefully it looks a little less... Oh, that's interesting. This one eats small animals. We're out of the plankton phase. Lived primarily on the ocean floor and attacked small animals there. Ooh. Yeah, boy, I'm going to be attacking some small animals. I'll tell you what. Come here, Thelotus. Doesn't even make a dent. So, yeah, that's a pretty good sign, probably, that we should be uh, moving on. So, let's go ahead and... Uh, now we can okay yeah now we're now we're in a whole new ballpark here we're gonna be it's gonna take a lot of the lotus grinding but fortunately that moves really quickly but i'm gonna start moving up in a little bit of a wiser direction and see what that does for me uh i am getting a lot of desperate attacks in so and i remember to uh pump up the uh tech speed again so that's probably oh something is happening an underwater volcano is erupting so I am walled off from the Thelotuses at this point. But I'm not walled off from enormous currents. Nine Evo genes. Boy, I'll take that. Maybe it's proportionate to the level of development you're at. That would be nice. So now we're out in the big old open ocean by ourselves. And there appears to be nothing out here. It seems we have 
Seems we're moving toward a cave. Moving toward a cave seems like a good place to stop to me. So we'll stop here and then investigate what's going on next time. I'm sure it's something a little bit stronger than a Thelotus. That's for sure. <laughs>